Yeah, hi. Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen, a little sad news in the world of wrestling. Um, so Daphne, who you guys may remember from TNA or um, even WCW, I didn't really remember her from WCW. I remember her more from TNA, but Daphne uh, has passed away. Um, so unfortunately, she committed suicide, I believe. Um, it's not said, but it most likely is unfortunately that's the case because she was threatening to commit suicide. She was obviously distraught um, in her Instagram live. She was doing an Instagram live and saying how she's going to kill herself, blah, blah, blah. Very sad. Okay. Um, it's obvious that she may have had some mental issues. So I would have hoped that she got help, but we didn't know. You know, we don't know. So I don't know what else to really say. Uh, then, uh, like, it, it's sad, you know, it's too late, unfortunately. Um, not gonna pretend I'm a big Daphne fan, because again, like, first of all, she wasn't really in TNA that long, um, to really, like, I mean, she was there just, I guess, for two years, right? I will say what I remember from her, her and the, the Dr. Stevie segments, you know, Stevie Richards, um, you know, I, I you know, uh, and also, like, she was... <laughs> I think she also was like supposed to strip down. Like remember when fucking TNA was the thing, uh, and they were like on Mondays, I believe. I think it was like the time when Vince Russo was writing and stuff like that. Apparently Vince Russo was very high on this person too. So and it's very sad that um, she passed away now. I don't know what to really say, but like I'm not gonna say I'm a big Daphne fan because uh, first of all, she wasn't there that long to make. People, I guess, Karen too. Um, I'm not gonna like say like, oh, she's great, or whatever. Um, it is star shame she passed away. Um, there's some f people who likes them freaky chicks. I don't know. She was too gothic for me, if if, if I be honest with you. But very sad um, that she passed away. Very sad that she's gone. Um, I mean, she was part of this Doctor Stevie stuff, you know, with, involving. I I remember. Her getting fucking thrown to the fucking barbed wire board. I think that was one of the most memorable moments of Daphne. Like her getting, but it was like what the monsters ball match. That was pretty cool. Cause actually, that's actually like again, that was one of the cool things about TNA and shit. So, and that was actually a really good match. I remember she was getting through that thrown to that fucking car um, cardboard with barbed wire. So that's definitely one of the memorable moments about Daphne. And also the Dr. Stevie stuff. So, you know, I do remember stuff about her. It's just that, again, I'm not going to act like a big fan. It's very sad. I will say this, that obviously suicide is not okay. Um, very sad that she... Uh, but again, like, it would have been nice if she got some help. It's obviously she needed help. She had mental issues. It's not like fucking what happened with that Hana something. That, that, that person who committed suicide last year for cyberbullying. I mean, obviously I get it. Things can, you know, she may have had some personal issues, but like again, I'm not going to I hate to be that kind of person, but yeah, definitely turn off the fucking internet if you're going to get get fucking bullied and shit like that. You're going to deal with that crap. I don't fucking know. Um not trying to be fucking hurtful, but that's the truth, but it's obvious with Daphne this is a different story. There's probably things going on in her personal life that uh, just her fucking up mentally and physically. She didn't look... <coughs> Definitely when I saw the, those videos of her being distraught, she didn't look the same as she used to. I'm not going to like try to turn that to a reason to hate on her or whatever. But it's obvious like she had some issues going on in her life. And she deserved some help. So I don't know what else to really say. I just... All I can say is the condolences to the family and friends, the loved ones to her. Very sad that she committed suicide. Obviously, suicide is no joke. And I do think that, you know what, hey, put your health first. Fucking, um, definitely I want to spread a new awareness to mental health. Crap, if I don't make that clear uh, in my other videos, obviously take care of yourself physically and mentally. Because if you're not fucking there mentally if you're not helping yourself mentally you're not going to be able to help yourself physically and shit like that i hope everyone does all right 
got like be in good health no matter what you know and um it's a darn shame we lost someone i don't want anyone to die because of fucking mental issues and they don't want them committing suicide i don't know i mean i hate to be generic oh like try to be there for someone but the reality is like maybe you should because for god's sakes obviously mental health is no fucking joke and fucking really, like, suicide ain't a joke, man. People committing suicide because they're mentally ain't there and shit like that. Physically and mentally. I'm telling you, fuck you. Especially in the kind of world we're in where, like, now COVID and shit. You know, people feeling alone or wherever. Fuck, they don't feel like they have anybody there. I'm telling y'all, man, we need to fucking fix this world, man. People need to be there for each other. Um... I don't know what to really say. Uh, it's a darn shame. But yeah, rest in peace to Daphne. Um, sucks that she did what she did. But again, like, it's not like fucking she was... I don't know. Like, man, this that's... She obviously was mentally distraught. She should have gotten some help. Obviously, we don't know, but um, I don't know. I hope if you... If, I hope everybody who ever watched this or whatever... I'm not gonna... I know I'm not gonna try to change the world, because who the fuck am I? But for real... Let's hope that, you know, if you have a problem, get get some help. Try to be, do something that you love. Try to enjoy life. Try to do something that you enjoy. Maybe that'll help your mental spirits. I mean, I know it's hard in the world. Like, sometimes we can't. But, I mean, in the end of the day, come on, man. You got to try to do something that makes you happy because, fuck, you're just gonna, it's just going to fuck up your life, man. I don't know what to tell you. Um, so, God bless everybody. Um, hope all is well in terms of mentally and physically uh and yes rest in peace to daphne because i'm telling you suzanne ain't no joke so um very darn shame that we lost uh someone in the wrath in the world and um god bless for the moments you know i do remember from tna not gonna be 10 i'm a big fan but definitely is a darn shame what happened uh god bless everybody all right and I don't know, don't take the internet too seriously. I mean, I'm not saying it's the internet issue. Um, it ain't fucking, because it's obviously something probably personal life shit that happened that what led to Daphne doing what she did. But let's be honest here. Uh, we need we need to fucking take care of ourselves because out of how fucking, I don't know, we got to fucking focus on ourselves, people, because life is going to fucking, eh, life's, I don't know what to say, man. Just, it's a darn shame. So take care, everybody. Rest in peace to Daphne, and take care of yourself, and if you have a problem, I don't know, get some help. I hate to be that kind of person, like, if you have a problem, get, like, but for real, really, because we don't, I don't want to hear people fucking committing suicide, I really don't, okay? It, it ain't no fucking joke, it just goes to show that, like, you know, I'm not gonna be person, oh, you're just doing for, te no, obviously not for attention, but it's obviously, like, fucking, you know, you probably have something going on in your life, but honestly, you need, I hope people do get their help. Because it's fucking sad, man. It's just sad. We don't need people dying because of fucking suicide. Okay? Because obviously fucking... You probably, people who haven't been there haven't been there. You know what I mean? So... So check up on your loved ones. I right, people. Peace. Yeah, bye.